<laughs> Hi guys, this is Lucas from Lucas World, and today I have uh, two new Rube Goldberg sets, which means I'm gonna build two new chain reactions. One of them is called the Garden Challenge, and the second is the Acrobat Challenge. But the real challenge today is focusing on STEM-based principles of buoyancy and pulleys. And the other set is spring forces and gravity. So let's say we'll start with the Garden Challenge. In this challenge, we'll build a chain reaction and see how the flower will grow. Now let's build our contraption. First, let's build a cage. Let's place seven blue bars into the base. Now let's attach these two gray pieces to the floor. And cover it with the lid. Now let's add the cage door with the two pound weight and place the bird cage onto the stand. Now let's attach the helping hand to the top of the bird's cage. And now add the gutter pipe to the top. Once finished, thread the string through the pulley. Now let's put the birdie in the cage, lock them up, and let's put the weight on the sidewalk side. Now let's build the second part of the contraption, starting with the lifeboat. Let's place the file cabinets onto the lifeboat, together with the flower pot. Now let's insert the flower into the pot and add the wooden ramp. Now let's place the tennis ball into the flower and the eight ball onto the gutter pipe. Now let's add water to the top of the watering can. Close the lid and now let's place the watering can on top of the file cabinet. All right, everything is set up. Now all we have to do is try to accomplish the garden challenge. First, the basketball hits the sidewalk sign, allowing the weight to drop down and open the birdcage door, allowing the bird to come out and catch the worm. That will tip over the gutter pipe and let the eight ball roll down and hit the watering can lid, which will pour water into the flower pot which will let go and release the tennis ball to trigger another contraption. Let's try it. There we go. Yay! It worked! First try! Mission accomplished! Yay! And it worked for the first time. That was a good example of pulleys and buoyancy. How does it work? Buoyancy and pulleys help complete our chain reaction. Pulleys are simple machines that allow you to change the direction that forces are working it. And buoyancy is another force that let water push the flower upward, allowing it to emerge from the pot and release the tennis ball. Pretty cool, right? Okay, now let's check out this acrobat challenge set. But the question is, can the basketball, monkey, and the tightrope make it the acrobat jump through the flaming hoop. Well, only one way to find out. So let's build the set. All right, all set. Here's what's gonna happen, or what should happen, because it's always tricky when it comes to science. All right, let's see. 
Basketball hits bullseye. Hitting over the flag pull it down, causing monkey to swing upright. Then the monkey rolled forward down the tightrope, hitting the snake. Making the tightrope drop as the monkey glides backwards down the tightrope. His sandbag knocks over the peanuts off the helping hand and into the popcorn box, causing the seesaw to tip. Wagon rolls down track onto the ramp where it is stopped by the barrier, causing the circus ball to roll out and hit the racket. Then the matchstick swings down, poking Fuse into the cannon, ejecting Acrobat Rube through the flaming hoop. And finally, Rube flies off to trigger another contraption, or break his neck. Just kidding, let's do it! Here goes nothing. Ah, the wagon missed! Let's adjust the ramp. Also, the monkey fell off the tightrope. Attempt number two. This time we need to do something about the monkey because it didn't hit the snake. It almost worked, but the bag fell by itself. Yay, it finally worked. Mission accomplished. Well, almost, but we'll take it. How does it work? Well, in this case, we use gravity. Like, remember, the monkey lowered the tightrope and the bag of peanuts dropped into the bag of popcorn. And we have spring forces because there is a spring inside this cannon that shot out the acrobat. Well, these were our other contraptions that we built from Ruth Goldberg. If you want to see more science videos, then stay tuned. Bye! And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Fly, Ruby! Fly!